Story from the Magic Drum by Sudha Murthy. Today's story, The Very Expensive Coconut. Chandrakant was a miser. He hated spending money on anything and his wife was tired of his stingy ways. One day Chandrakant went to a wedding. There he was served coconut perfume. Chandrakant felt he had never tasted anything so good and decided he wanted another one. He went back home and asked his wife to make him one. His wife looked at him and said, You hardly give me enough money to cook dal and rice. How will I cook, make burfi? Go and buy the coconut at least and then I will make burfi for you. So Chandrakan set off for the market. He saw a man sitting by the roadside with a heap of coconuts. He selected one and asked, How much is this for? The man who knew Chandrakant and his miserliness, well, like everyone else in the bazaar, said, Five rupees. Chandrakant nearly fainted when he heard this. Five rupees for a coconut? Seeing his face, the shopkeeper said, Walk ahead. You will come to a coconut grove 10 kilometers from here. There you will get coconuts for 3 rupees. Chandrakant thought this was a wonderful idea. What if he had to walk 10 kilometers? He would save 2 full rupees. So he walked and after an hour he reached the grove. When he saw the coconuts, he felt that even 3 rupees was a very high price for them and asked the gardener, Will you give it to me? For one rupee? The gardener was busy without looking around. He said, Ten kilometers from here, there is another coconut grove. You can get it for one rupee. He would save two more rupees. Chandrakant set off at once. Tired, he reached the next coconut grove. But when he saw the coconuts, he felt like haggling again and asked the gardeners, Will you give me a coconut for 50 pice? The gardener was upset. Walk 10 kilometers further. You will reach the seashore where there are many coconut trees. Just pluck one. You will get it for free. Free? Chandrakant would walk to the end of the earth to get anything for free. He walked and walked and finally reached the seashore. Sure enough, there were rows of trees with coconuts hanging from them. Anybody could just climb up and take it. Chandrakant started climbing up. Up and up he went. On the highest treetop, he grabbed a delicious looking coconut. Just then his, a gust of wind shook the tree and he lost his hold. He held on the coconut for dear life. Help, he shouted. A man came by on an elephant. When he saw Chandrakant hanging on to the coconut, he went up to the tree. Chandrakant begged him, Sir, will you stand on the elephant and hold my legs so that I can get down? The Mahot said, I am in hurry, but if you give me a hundred rupees, I will do. A hundred rupees? But Chandrakant would break his bones if he remained there. He would have to pay up, he agreed sadly. The man stood on his elephant and grabbed his legs. But just then the elephant moved away and both of them were left hanging there. Chandrakant was even more worried. Then they saw a horseman and both of them begged. Will you stand on the horse and hold our feet so that we can get down? The horseman said, only if you give me a thousand rupees. There was no other way out, so Chandrakant agreed. But when the man grabbed their feet, the horse got scared and galloped away. Everyone fell in a heap and a bunch of coconut fell on them. They broke their bones and Chandrakant had to pay a thousand rupees for their treatment. 
in all because you would not pay 5 rupees for a coconut. End of story.